Uh, hi, my name is Jan Fein. Uh, a little bit about myself. Um, since I was seven, I've been into video games. Still, kind of still am. And uh, just that general, you know, appreciation of like how, you know, electricity, a controller and this computing device, you know, your video game console is able to make this expansive world of imagination come to life was like really interesting. That in tandem with the fact that, um, you know, when we use computers in our day to day, you know, surfing the internet, using the email, stuff like that, stuff like that, and that nobody around me was really able to give me a deeper insight on how that this worked was really uh, interesting to me. So that just kind of led me into the path of wanting to just, you know, engage in the STEM fields. Uh, initially, when I entered in college, I wanted to get into game development, but my university unfortunately didn't have a game development uh, major. So I just figured, okay, I'll, I'll get into computer science because I figured, you know, that I'll have the programming fundamentals that I could then pivot into the game the industry. What was interesting is, um, as uh, <clears throat> you know, as I was kind of continuing to take my uh, computer science courses, that I really wanted to have a better understanding of how the software that I developed interacts with the hardware. Because while it was cool that I was able to utilize the computer at a higher rate or higher level than I see the average person, I still didn't really understand how me writing code, you know, me engaging with like all of this code stuff made the computer do this. I didn't understand how by, you know, engaging with main and these data types that I was able to, you know, create, uh, you know, these wonderful software. So like, then I ended up pivoting over towards computer, sorry, to computer engineering, which is essentially the marriage of electrical engineering and uh, computer science. I find that to be very fulfilling as it now really has filled in the has filled in the gaps and made me appreciate both the physical hardware component side and seeing how let's say the the the, the material sciences and the physics and chemistry leads toward these wonderful machines and such. Um, I enjoy algebra. I enjoy math. Thankfully, while I'm not going to sit here and say I'm the best at it or the fastest, I think that my foundational fundamentals have allowed me to always figure out the answer, give me enough time. Obviously, with you know computers and programming, it's also pretty nice to have the com also be able to write my own scripts that can do the mathematics for me, which I think is very helpful. Uh, one of the underlying motivations of me being on this platform is to see other people, you know, reach their fullest potential when it comes to the STEM fields. To some degree, we're all forced to do a little bit of mathematics, right, until at least we graduate, like, high school. I, I would like to see more people engage in the STEM field. I think that there's a lot of uh, contributions that people can do by learning these skill sets. But even if you, you know, decide not to or realize that your skills are just better served in other places, I would like your confidence to be built in these, in the field, in these fields, in the mathematics, the mathematical departments, maybe algebra, calculus, trigonometry, geometry, maybe any form of programming, that you can at least tell yourself and be confident in saying that you know how to solve this problem if you give it enough time. I hope that you consider uh, my uh, tutoring services and, uh, you know, let's, uh, let's see what happens. Take care.